Good morning, Lily Allen. Hi. How are you today? I'm really good today. <laughs> Why is that, Lily Allen? I got nominated for Mercury. Bloody hell. Um, does that mean anything to you in terms of critical appraisal, etc.? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I think, you know, it's not really one. I don't think that the record labels and the, um, the fans can sort of swing this one. You know, it's, it's a panel of people that know what they're talking about. So that's what, you know, that's why it means something to me. Um, and I don't, you know, I don't think record companies like to put spend behind it. You know, it just is what it is. So it feels like natural and organic as opposed to some of the other award ceremonies. And, you know, this, this award and the Ivan Novellos for me are the two, the two big ones. And, you know, I won three Ivers and now I've been nominated for this. So I'm happy. It's a heavy mantelpiece. Yeah. <laughs> um, what do you think it is about No Shame that's caught people's imaginations? Um, actually, I think it's probably not caught people's imagination. I think that it is just so frank and it is what it is that, that you, people don't need to use their imagination. It just is there. Um, and I, I don't know, maybe that's, that's what it is, is that it's just so sort of black and white. And yeah. I think your book will have a similar impact? Uh, I hope so. Any huge surprises in there? Um, well, well, not for me, because I wrote it, but, <laughs> um, yeah, maybe. And finally, anyone nominated, uh, not nominated, that you think should have been? Shame. I really thought Shame would be nominated. What do you think is special about that album? Um, just new style, new voices, and good lyrics, yeah. And finally, what would you do with the prize money if you won? <laughs> um, I'd put it into my post-Brexit, um, marketing account. <laughs> <laughs> Probably to pay for visa applications come April next year. <laughs>